marking for the tibial nerve block. So this is the medial malleolus here. So this is the lower end of medial malleolus. This is the lower end of. So put a vertical line down, 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 down. So from here, about a finger bits down. So this is the finger bits down. One finger bits down. In the same line from the tip of the malleolus, one finger bits down and about a one finger width anterior right one finger width down and one finger width quadrilly so this is the point here and this is the pulsating posterior tibialarity right or you can say this is about 2 cm 2 cm below and 2 cm this is here this is 1.5 cm you can say this is the 1.5 cm posterior and 1.5 cm anterior so 1.5 cm posteriorly and 1.5 cm down so here this is the RT and the puncture point is these two points. So one finger width down or you can say 1.5 cm down and from this point so this is 1.5 cm inferiorly, quadrally, right? And here you can palpate the posterior RT and the entry point is on either side of this RT. BD syringe 1 ml with 26 gauge needle now the tip of my finger is over this artery now inject on either side we take choti sui lagegi bas daba dal lo hilana nahi aspirate so i have taken 2 ml 2% jalokin without deadly because I want a short anesthesia aspirate and then inject right. withdraw the needle and go superficially lift it up and then anesthetize the other puncture point so I have injected 1 ml of gel point there won't be any pain insert the needle aspirate no blood Aspirate, no blood, aspirate, radio frequency. So this is the second pass. Pour out this area. Mm-hmm. 
lâu rồi em from the base of grade 2 by using radio frequency coagulation setting at about 2 so we have removed this callosity by putting the C here because this base is quite clean this is quite clean it's all plain it's quite clean few pinpoint bleeding at two points are there now after eight pass of RF I have totally removed the callosity and the wound you can see is quite clean and there is nothing exposed in the base. So this is likely to heal in time and there is hardly any pressure.